Hello friends, welcome again. This is my new project online show store and I have this project in PHP and MySQL. The version for the PHP I am using is the PHP version 7 and MySQL version is 5.6. I am using the Jam server for running this project, right? But if you have WAMP server, other PHP and MySQL based server, then you can easily configure and run this project on those server too. Right. So for front-end development, I have used HTML, CSS, JavaScript, some of the jQuery library. Also, I have used like for form validations, creating browser menus, integration of the date calendar plugins. I have used the jQuery plugins. Right. So these all technology stacks I have used for developing this project online SUI store. Right. So let's start with the functionality with them. So so the project title is online SUI store and it's PHP and MySQL web-based mini DBMS project. Mini because it has only and only customer operations. There is no login uh, for ad admin because it's a mini project, right? Mini project, you can develop a single user-based system. There is no need of developing multiple role-based system, right? So this technology stacks and uh, this is the type of the project, right? DBMS because we have used a MySQL database uh, for storing the data. That's why it's a DBMS project, right? So let's start with the functionality go through. So this is the home page of the project. You can see this is the home page and some shoes are coming on the home page and these shoes are coming from the database. So this is a totally dynamic page and this all shoes are coming from the database. So currently we have added six, uh, 12 shoes, but if you want to add more, you can add the details into the database directly. There is no admin panel available for that. This is the about project and it's a static about page and there is nothing dynamic on it. This is all shoes, all shoes will be displayed here. I already told you there are 12 shoes we have added. This is all companies means you can filter out shoes according to the company, Adidas, Puma. If you click on the Adidas, you will be able to see all of the shoes which belongs to that Adidas. This is all types meant what type of shoes you want to buy, man, women, kids or formal, right? Once you click on that, then you will get the details, means details of that, uh, that footwear means shoes right this is a login from where customer can login and after login customer will be able to purchase the shoe without login customer will not be able to buy the products this is a registration if you don't have the user id and password then you can register from here and after that you will be able to buy the products means shoes or footwear this is a contact us page and this is a static contact us page i am not saving the value of this contact us page anywhere into the database even i am not sending any type of email and sms from this page right so now i am going to log in as a customer so the user id is customer and password steps once you log in inside the system you will get this dashboard you can see there is a menu option the menu options are different because it's a session event it renders according to the session if customer login then the menu will be different if customer is logged then menu will be different right let me go through one, all of the menus one by one so this is home page I already explained you. This is about, I already explained you. This is a dashboard from dashboard. These are the menu options. You can jump on that page on clicking on this menu, right? This is a shopping, right? I think it's a medicine, it's a wrong, right? This is a my orders from where you will be able to see all of the orders which you have purchased, right? Once you pick up the view details, you will be able to see the details of the order. This is my, my account section from where you will be able to see your my account section. This is a change password from where you will be able to update your account password and all about. Now I am going to buy some of the shoes. Right. If this is wrong, the text is wrong, we will correct it. Right. So this is belly. Now I am adding it to the cart. You can see this belly I have added it into the cart. This is three, and you can see the items total cost is calculating automatically one the total cost is calculating automatically right this is all companies now retail this one and added cart so two items i have added into the cart now i am going to add one more card this one right so three items now you don't need this just click on the delete that item will be deleted from your cart right so you have two items, this is the belly and goods, right? And total amount you need to pay is 5,500 rupees. Once you click on the place order, then you will get a payment page, dummy payment page, where it's saying that you need to pay 
5,500 rupees. Right here, you need to enter the card number and the customer name dummy. This is the dummy payment gateway. There is no need of entering the credit credit card details. Just use any type of garbage values, right? And the card type, CV number, and the amount. Amount you can't change because it's a read all the Once you click on the make payment, you will get this confirmation page. Here you are seeing that. Okay, dear Amit Kumar, Amit Kumar is the name of the customer. This is confirmation of your order number 11 has been successfully placed on date this, right? It's a good edit. You can see the details in the my order section, right? So you can see you have placed more than 10 orders. So it's in the last. Right? Once you click on the view details, you will be able to see the details, right? Okay, so this is the flow of the project. Okay, so the last option is logout. Once you click on the logout, the above administrative menu will not be displayed. But if you log in, then above administrative menu will be displayed, right? So this all functionality I have developed inside this page online shoe store. And as I told you earlier, this is a PHP and MySQL web-based mini DBMS project, right? If you need more functionality in this project, just put it into the comment. I will incorporate the changes. I will make this project more better and better according to requirements. And don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos on the latest houses. Thanks for watching the video. Thank you very much.